All right, good morning. It's, uh, what is it, November 18th, 2018. Um, I wanted to create a video. I had some folks ask for uh, some help with the cutting wrappers in Bentec. And also, I had a request for multi-plane, multi-bent parts. Um, so you know, basically one tube that, that you bend and then between bends, you add rotation into it. And so the goal of, of this video is to illustrate, um, how I do that. Um, I'm going to start here in the software on a, a simple, uh, design for an early Bronco engine cage that, uh, I designed a while back and, um, and I'm going to, uh, show you how to do the software part of it here and then uh, the video will switch to me in the garage and I'll show you how to 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 set the bender up for uh, multiple uh, planes and how I do that and um, and then we'll even uh, after I get the parts bent I'll show you how to do the um, the cut wrappers and, and, uh, illustrate how you actually, you know, um, wrap them around the tube and mark your tube and, and, uh, and all that good stuff. So anyways, here we go. So uh, here I am in Bentec. I've got a, my engine cage. Uh, I've got a new version here. It's a pretty simple design, uh, that I designed for, um, my brother, uh, it was the last year, two years ago. Um, but anyways, uh, as you can see, this these tubes here, the, let's see, the rights and lefts, these are um, one tube. So you can see there's a bend and it's got multiple different planes here. So it's three bends with, uh, what is it, three different rotations it looks like. And so we'll be, uh, we'll be bending one of these in our example, and then um, and then we'll do our cutting wrappers for these uh, radiator hoops here. So first things first, um, go into, since the parts are already designed, I'm not really gonna go into that for this video, but um, I purposely don't have any cut wrappers here for the parts. And for, for this video, uh, I'm gonna, disregard these inner fender um forget about these inner parts i'm not going to do any coping for those but but uh so what we need to do here is create our cut wrappers for this upper radiator mount and this lower radiator mount um so first thing you do you go up into new cut and select the first tube so let me zoom in here. So this is, we're gonna select the first tube. This is the tube that we want to cut. And then you select the, the tubes that will make up the profile. So as you can see, it's just this, just this, uh, you know, um, passenger side engine hoop, uh, main hoop, whatever we wanna call it. And so you hit complete and there you go. You can see the blue and black there is your inner and outer you know tube profile so um and then you can see here in the in the screen we've got our front upper hoop uh the start side so now let's get the end side of this tube so let's go up here new cut and let's pan around here so we can see this a little bit better um and do the same thing we've got we're going to select the tube that's the one we want to make the cut and you select the one that creates the profile and hit complete and there you go so we've got a start and an end to the upper hoop so let's do the bottom real quick new cut let's select that tube and select this and there you go complete new cut that tube and this tube complete okay so here we are we've got let's go into our display we've got our coping wrappers done and so the next thing is is you uh, in order to print these things out um, 
uh, you select one, just like I've highlighted, you select one of these, and let's start with the top, and you can even go into details to see what that'll look like before you print it. And so um, here it is. Uh, that's that's the co coping wrapper that uh, Bentec spits out at us. Um, these are fantastic, um, you know, for for even if you have a uh, hole saw uh, coping tool or or not you can cut these out with a you know a skinny wheel and and touch it up with a you know a flap disc if you want I do that sometimes so um, anyways you'll uh, you'll print all four of these out as you can see they'll be they'll be unique um, to each other and um, and so I'll print those out real quick and then we'll head to the garage. 